Hey guys, Tyler here. Welcome back to Patrick's Parabox. This is a puzzle game inside a puzzle game inside a puzzle game. Repeat to infinity. This is a wonderful must-play puzzle game about recursion. Let me show you how it works. The goal is to get the box into the box hole, as well as yourself into the hole with eyes. It's a very simple premise. And this level seems to start us off with a very basic version of that and this is a funny level because when you enter a box you always enter through the middle so you're like oh how can you access this box well one you could either push it out but you can't actually push it out you can't do a turnaround what you instead need to do is i guess line it up in the middle of the box so you can push it in it seems these first couple levels are about inception but i assure you there is plenty of recursion in this game this world is just called center, so I guess we're dealing with things that are in the center. So, I have this here. I'm not quite sure what- oh! Oh! I see, the idea is that you push it out and push it back in, so now it's in the center, and now I can push it out. And now I can actually enter this block for my own goal. So this is a funny little thing. Here we got a level inside a level inside a level. And they're just little void blobs, so I guess we're just meant to do it again. Uh, we gotta be careful, because you can only enter a block if it's up against the wall. This seems to work out well this time. Really hammering in the idea of that. Next, I should go over here for a hard version of a level. Interesting. Just gotta get one block into the center. Well, how hard could that really be? Because I imagine that I've got to free up this red block somehow oh hold on if I set the red block here and then move here now I can do something oh what it might accomplish is this this way I can push the red into the yellow push them both over like this oh is there any way I can push the red up now yes there is from here i can enter from the bottom and now i can send it up i guess i entered from the top but you saw what's happening it's a minimalist game so the visuals are very easy to tell what's going on the hard part's the explanation and now we got some recursion the level is inside itself in the corner and i've got to free up this red block which is normally pushed against the wall so i got to find some way to free it well if i push it out I can now go here, and then I can push it back in, so now it's up against the wall, so now I'll push it up, and then back down, and now I can push it into its goal. Yeah, so pushing it back in always recenters it. Well, what's this then? More recursion, a wonderful repeat of what we've just gone through, and two levels. So let me try pushing this down first, so I can push this up. And then back in. Question is, how am I pushing out this one that's clearly in the corner? Oh, wait a second. Reset. What if I push this down and then eight? Like that. There we go. Did a little bit of consuming of the block. Now I have two more accessible blocks. I can push this down like that. And then this goes over to the side and out. And actually both could have gone to the side now that I think about it. But either way, what's done is done. I've unlocked further worlds, but I do want to be a completionist here. I think it's more fun that way. So I've got to have a level here, but I can't enter because the tiny block is, well, blocking my entrance. Whoops. So what I want to do is push this here so I can just get this out of the way. And that should be enough for me to enter. There we go. What exactly is this trying to teach me? This is a weird looking level. Okay, just pick a side, any side to enter from. Wait, I can't enter from this side? Can I enter from here? Wait, what? Oh, I can only enter in the center. <laughs> I see, so it's a level inside a level inside a level. Oh, look at that. My goal's way in here, so I just have to enter. Enter at the center. Good to know. Let's try this. So I just got to get two blocks onto their goals. Well, if I set this up here and set this up here, can't I just 
Oh, I can't enter from there, though. Well, I can push this one out because I can enter from the center. But the other one, not so much. Oh, I have to set this up here and then go into the empty space and push it out. That should have been more obvious. I'm surprised it took me so long. Anyway, let's go on to these. There's just one goal? Is that right? Oh, but what's hard about it is that if I put a block onto the goal, I can't get to my own goal. So, it revolves around this. Well, I think the idea is that I've just got to set up some of these here, and then can I enter? No, because it eats. Oh, interesting. So, let me try something instead. You got to actually push it down, because it's still going to eat here. But, before I do that... I think it's gonna look something like this. You eat once, and then, oh, I can't enter it though. Oh, never mind. I'm s so, uh, I, how did I forget? The idea is that you just gotta eat somewhere. Just have it eat two blocks, and then I can enter it and rearrange it to my liking. Is this to my liking? Yeah, it's, it's enough to my liking. Because this way I eat both, and now I can enter it. And then that solves the level. Had the idea, just the execution was iffy. Well, it seems like I just gotta push this block in. How hard could that be? Oh, let me back out for a second. Let me push this over one. Because if I enter, I need to be able to exit while still leaving this block accessible. It, this, that level just had one trick to it. This one's got a bit of a harder trick. It means I just gotta push this block into here. I see. So if I enter from this side, I can push this to be here, which I think is where I want it to be. Yes, this would be right, because this way I can push it up. Position matters, is what I'm learning. Interesting hallways. So between the two goals down here, I think one has to be for the orange and one has to be for the yellow. There's no way that it's for both. Let me try something. Let me put the orange into the yellow you can consume and then push the yellow inside the green. And then let me set up the yellow right here. I think that's the idea at least. Because now, oh no, this whole thing gets pushed out. That's not right. Let me reset, actually. So what happens if I just push both of these into the green one at a time? Maybe it's way simpler than what I was making it out to be. Yeah, I think it's way simpler than what I was making it out to be. Yeah, it is. Because look at that. That's why one needs to be bendy. Because if the, the, the gold block was solid and I couldn't enter it, this orange block would be stuck. So if... Because there's a hallway, that means I can let one of them exit. And then let both of them exit and go to their goals. Yeah, that's only possible because the yellow one's bendy. Well, let's go to this. This is a text-based level. Distilling it down to its most basic idea. There's layer 1 and layer 2. This takes me a layer 2. This is a box. I've got to push this over and then come out. And then push this box down and then enter from the side, and then push the box out to his goal here, and then I can win here. Nice, text space. two text space levels, it's three layers deep. Okay, so this leads me to level one, this leads me to layer two, and this leads me to layer three. The box just needs to get all the way over. Oh, this is weird. So here, this is super weird. I think this needs to be pushed down to here. Then I can exit and exit. No, this is not correct. Oh, I need I need a reset. Because I'm pretty sure I can't push this down into box two. I need to reset because what needs to happen is that this needs to... Um, what needs to happen is that this needs to enter box two from the side, so it can be positioned right where it is right now. Then I can push this down, and then I can exit, push this out to its goal, 
and then make it to my goal myself. Good God, okay. Understanding it even at its most basic. Well, I completed the center, and now there's a splitting path. Two options of where to go. I think I'll choose the leftmost one to clone. This is a ton of levels. These worlds are getting bigger and bigger. 